The year was 1941. People travelled from all across London to attend the Shabbat service. The stained glass windows of this very sanctuary were either blacked out or boarded up. Air raid sirens rang across the city, and yet the faithful congregants of the West London Synagogue of British Jews were not to be deterred by the Blitz. Their resilience was admirable. They were determined not to let the Nazis and their anti-Semitism stop them from practicing their Judaism within this, their spiritual home. During heavy aerial bombardments, services were relocated to the Stern Hall, but more often than not, prayers went ahead in this very sanctuary, with the rumbles of war ricocheting off the walls. Such was the dedication of those who came before us that, come what may, they were going to stand in their synagogue and pray for king, country, and loved ones serving on the front line. It is in honour of that remarkable wartime spirit, commemorating their courage, that we must come together this Saturday, poppies on our chests, to mark Remembrance Shabbat at exactly 11am on the 11th day of the 11th month. And at this challenging time, we know just how important it is to be together as a community. In recent years, our moving Remembrance Shabbat service has seen a significant drop in attendance as we lose more and more veterans. This Shabbat is in fact the first time in many years that we are marking Armistice Day itself on a Shabbat. We have a bugler and wartime songs. We will be joined by members of Ajax and the Deputy Mayor of Westminster. We will have a standard bearer and the lowering of the synagogue wartime flag during our long roll of honour of First and Second World War victims. It is such a moving service. And so if there's any way in which you can join us, we know that your presence will be much appreciated. And if you are able to attend, please get here before 10.30 a.m. because we will head into the sanctuary just after 10.45 in good time for the two minutes of silence. Back in 1941, we stood in our synagogue. Now in 2023, let's do the same. Together, we will remember those who gave their today for our tomorrow. Yiskor, may God remember them. Shabbat Shalom. Shalom.